Congratulations on your big win against Cody at the Rumble. Huh. <laughs> Feels good to finally quiet the critics. Indeed. And good to have you back here on Raw 2. Although last time you visited, it ended with me sporting a black eye. Ah, it was a heated moment and you got caught in the crossfire. Sorry about that. We good? I've been in this business for 40 years. If I cut ties with everyone who's punched me in the face, I'd have no friends. I'm glad we can move past that and focus on what's next. Don't you mean, who's next? Since you're holding all the gold, you'll be facing the winner of last night's Royal Rumble match, Montez Ford. I've been wanting to mix it up with him for years. WrestleMania is going to be huge when I tear the house down with Ford and tie Roman's record. Well, we're going to give the WWE Universe a preview of WrestleMania when you and Montez have a little chat in the ring tonight. Let's do this. The newly crowned double champion is here on Raw to kick off the road to WrestleMania. Ladies and gentlemen, it is my distinct pleasure to introduce to you the undisputed WWE Universal World Heavyweight Champion. That's quite a mouthful, champ. I agree. Maybe we'll just call him the undisputed champion from now on. Well, hello there, Raw! <laughs> it's pretty damn cool to be back where I started but on a whole different level. Speaking of reaching a whole new level, I'm not the only guy who had a good night at the Royal Rumble. See, there's a man who's got a WrestleMania main event to cash in. A superstar who's ready to make the leap. Honestly, he reminds me a bit of myself from a few years back. So let me introduce you to this year's winner of the Royal Rumble match, Montez Ford! Oh, we're gonna see it now. The two biggest dogs in the yard are gonna face off. Both these men look ready to go. Well, they're gonna have to wait until WrestleMania. It's a mutual respect between Ford and the champion. What's this? It's not the best time for technical difficulties. It's Roman Reigns! This guy will not let our champion celebrate a single moment. Undisputed, huh? <laughs> Look at you. Peacocking around like you mean something. That title you took from Cody at the Rumble? They made it up. Because nobody could beat me. I am so tired of hearing people compare you to me. Are you so deluded that you really think I would let a pretender like you tie my record with the universal title? Nah. Mm -mm. Come on. You shouldn't even be there. Montez Ford! You're a young man with a bright future. I'm sorry to say this, but you're not the guy I can count on to beat this clown at Mania. So there's been a change of plans. See? What I did is I took a big briefcase full of my Hollywood money, flew in my private jet out to the woods of Minnesota, and I hired myself a hunter knows a little something about ending streets at Mania. Hope it was fun while it lasted. Shame. What? The Beast is back! Montez Ford isn't going to roll over for anyone. Here we go. F5 on the stage from Brock. Ford is hurt. 
but here comes the champion. No, Solo Sokoa. Has the bloodline reunited? It certainly looks that way. Brock Lesnar just broke Ford's arm. Regal trying to restore some order. Stereo super kicks right to the GM's jaw. No, they have to stop. Regal's not a competitor anymore. Welcome to Suplex City, champ. Montez Ford is down. Regal is down. Dark Horse is down. Who can stop Brock Lesnar and the Bloodline? The reunited Bloodline and Brock are working together to break the undisputed champion before he can make it to WrestleMania. And the champ can't do a damn thing about it. Isn't this great? Roman's brilliant plan put Regal in the hospital. So there's no debate now. Who's the best GM in WWE? It's me! You are the picture of class, Miz. I have exactly zero patience for you or any of this. I want the bloodline, and I want them now. I am generally not in the give the dark horse what he wants business, but in this case, I cannot wait to see Brock and the bloodline break you and your big dreams of beating Roman's record at Mania. Hmm. You're gonna be disappointed. You don't even sound sure yourself, but whatever. You wanna get the hell kicked out of you on the way to Mania? Who am I to stop the fun? Hey, I hear you're going after the Bloodline after what they did to you and Regal. I am. They're gonna get what's coming to them. Nobody knows the Bloodline better than I do. I know your story, Sammy. You don't. You only know what you saw on TV. Let me help you take them down. Sammy, I appreciate that. I do. But this is something I have to do on my own. Look, I tried to take out the bloodline alone and it didn't work. You need backup. I owe my career to Regal. I wouldn't be where I am today if it wasn't for him having faith in me when nobody else did. And then the bloodline tore him apart while I did nothing. Nothing. I hear you, but I'm telling you, you're making a mistake trying to do this alone. We haven't even talked about the fact that they have Brock Lesnar now. I don't have time for any of this. I'm done talking. I'm taking down the bloodline. Now. Well. I tried. Good luck, champ. You're gonna need it. With the bloodline reunited and stronger than ever, you can see the confidence in Solo Sokoa. It's the undisputed champ! He's taking a big risk if you ask me. This is our undisputed champion attacking Solo in the parking lot? What has the bloodline been up to for the past few years? This is a small taste of their own medicine. The champ better finish what he started here because what you don't want is an angry Solo Sokoa coming after you. He's returning fire. Done. Vicious right forearm with the reversal. Boom! Right on target. Bang! Take a seat at the table. He's got a plan for that table, and it does not involve a dinner party. today. Capitalizing on Sakoa's mistake.
The champion with a hard strike. But here come the Usos. You attack one member of the bloodline, you attack them all. This could be a repeat of what happened when they reunited. And Solo with the spike. And now they're sending him up for something else. Right into the side of that car. He might be joining Regal and Montez Ford on the IR when this is over. What is Jey Uso directing them to do? It looks like the champ's about to go for a ride. Shades of the shield. No, not this. Down onto the car. The champ bit off more than he could chew. And this guy isn't even going to make it to Brock Lesnar at WrestleMania. For the second time, the newly reformed bloodline has left our undisputed champion lying.